animal lovers will be happy to know that they can bring their pets with them when moving to Thailand. There are just certain requirements that need to be met and which are best handled several weeks in advance of the big move. There are also several animals which aren't allowed. So with no further ado, let's get started. start off with permitted animals into Thailand. Thailand does allow most domestic pets to be imported, but pit bull terriers and American Staffordshire terriers are exceptions and are prohibited. Rabbits are subject to the same requirements as most dogs and cats. But birds, invertebrates, tropical fish, reptiles, amphibia and rodents may have to meet different requirements and should have a health certificate to enter Thailand. If you have a rather unique pet, such as a turtle or a parrot, you should verify that it is not protected under the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora, or CITES, as you will need to apply for additional permits if this is the case. For help with procedures and regulations, it is advisable to contact an experienced pet relocation specialist for guidance. Next is the requirements for pets moving to Thailand. Thailand does not require a rabies data test or FAVN for pets entering from any country, but your pet will need to be microchipped so that it can be easily identified. Thailand currently accepts AVID 9 and AVID 10 microchips, in addition to ISO standard 11784 or ISO standard 11785 microchips. Once the microchip has been implanted, your pet needs to be administered with an inactivated rabies vaccine. You must be able to provide the original rabies certificate on arrival, and this certificate must state the microchip number, the date of inoculation, and how long the vaccine lasts. Dogs must also be vaccinated against canine distemper, parvovirus, leptospirosis, and hepatitis, or DHLPP. While cats must be inoculated against feline cat flu or Khaleesi virus, feline viral rhinotracheitis, chlamydia, and feline parvovirus. Your pet must have had all the necessary vaccines at least 21 days before arriving in Thailand, but no more than a year before. So what about puppies and kittens? Puppies and kittens will need to be vaccinated when they are at least 3 months old and will need to wait for 30 days after their inoculations before they can enter the country. This means that the minimum age for import is 4 months old. Within 10 days of the date that your pet is due to fly, you should obtain a completed vet health certificate form, or Form 7001 from an accredited veterinarian. You will also need to obtain an import permit from the Bangkok Animal Quarantine Station, which is valid for 45 days from its date of issue. Now comes to the moving process. All pets must be inspected 48 hours before their departure for their export license to be granted. The export license and health certificate shall be issued after the inspection and a copy will be sent to the owner before departure. Upon arrival in Thailand, it is possible that your pet may be subject to up to 30 days of quarantine if they do not meet certain requirements. Once any inspections and tests have acceptable results, you will be able to take your pet home. Pets can fly to Suwanapum International Airport in Bangkok and they can travel in the cabin or as checked baggage or air cargo, depending on the airline and the size of your pet. Your pet should not be exposed to other animals if they are transiting in another country, so they will only be allowed to stay in an officially approved quarantine area during any transit. Now comes to pet movers in Thailand. There are lots of companies offering relocation services and most of them provide processing paperwork. Some are also handling all the process, which includes flight reservation, veterinary services, and pet delivery. One of the most popular sources of pet relocation services is the International Pet and Animal Transportation Association. 
This is a non-profit organization where they have various companies who are members of the association. It is better to contact them before agreeing with the pet service of your choice to be able to feel secure having your pet transferred. They can provide you with a list of trustworthy pet shippers, avoiding frauds and scams. As for the authority in Thailand that oversees relocation of pets, you can contact the authority of the Bureau of Disease Control and Veterinary Services, Department of Livestock Development. The address and the phone number is on the screen right now. And that's it for this clip, guys. I hope you find this information useful and hope you can bring your beloved pets, cats, dogs, or whatever animal of your choice to Thailand safely and happily. Please join in the conversation and leave your comments if you have any. See you next time.